to this working party on university education. We want Kenyans to give views. This is our country, and none of us would be seated on this platform here with this red carpet if we did not go to school. And that is why teachers must be respected. They must be respected. Never again, never again in our administration will any government officer from the president all the way down will ever demean and humiliate teachers in front of students. The humiliation that was done to Professor Wainaina of Kenyatta University is regrettable. And that is why the government has reinstated him. Because he was embarrassed and humiliated in front of his students. It is wrong. I will not be here myself as Deputy President if I did not go to school. Your CS will not be. Even if all of you here, the DCCs, the education officers, one way or another you owe some gratitude to some teacher somewhere. True or false? Teachers must be respected. It's a noble profession. It's a calling. Nobody can ever adequately compensate a teacher. But when you get educated, then you get a big seat. You think you are God, you abuse teachers like children. That thing we don't want to ever happen again. And in our administration, we not only have respect for teachers, but for all public servants. Let us respect people. It doesn't matter how low they are. One day they'll go up, just like you have gone up your day. Tuwe shimiyane tafadhali. Na tuwache kiburi na maringo. Haisaidi mtu yeyote. Wacha tuwe shimiyane. All of us are working for the same government. It's only some are first among equals, but we are the same people. I look at management myself from the perspective of being a team leader. When you are county director of education, you are the team leader in that sector. Don't load over others and shout at them nini before they are juniors. Just if you have an issue with somebody who is a junior to you, Call the office and lock the door and talk to that person between the two of you in private. Yeah? If you think the matter has gone out of heart, put a letter. But don't call your juniors in front of the other juniors and lecture them. And then you expect them to continue managing those people. That respect will not be there.